What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my friends, subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Scorpio, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for sign of Scorpio. This can resonate if you have Scorpio in any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or the main energy of your charts. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. This is for September of 2022, so this can resonate if you have Scorpio in any aspect to your charts, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or no Moon, Haven, or Jupiter charts. Um, it's a free general collective reading, and it's very important to only take the messages that resonate with the rest. These are psychic, intuitive, prophetic messages, so one may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply, none may apply. Only you know your specific story and situation, not anybody else. You have to plug it in how it resonates, okay? Um I did receive uh, some channelings for Sign of Scorpio, and as always, plug them in how they resonate. If you think anyone else would like my channel, please feel free to share it very publicly on social media and word of mouth. Very much appreciate it. Thanks, everybody, for all the new sub subbies, and thanks for all the recent donations. I appreciate it. Okay, so um, the channel message I received was, or one of them was, <clears throat> uh, Scorpio's son i heard your uh for one of you guys your son for one your uh former lover and for one your baby mama is about to get arrested soon um uh for one your baby daddy and for one your baby daddy i just heard that for one your baby daddy so for some it is your son about to get arrested soon for so, you have to plug it in how it resonates for one it's your son sorry i've got sleepy kitty cat over here for one, it's your son about to get arrested soon. For one, it is your baby mama about to get arrested soon. For one, it's your baby daddy about to get arrested soon. For one, it is a former lover. So former lover, meaning you have had sexual relations with them in some shape, form, or fashion. That could be a situation ship, sneaky link, third party, committed partner, what have you, what have you. Um, these are not you, Scorpio. This is somebody you're connected to, whether it's your son biological or adopted i'm feeling um baby mama baby daddy or um former lover you plug it in how it resonates scorpio holy moly all right he's so lovey he's so lovey i love it For one, it's a lawyer about to get arrested. Oh my God, whoa. For one, it's a lawyer about to get arrested. There's a lot of people about to get arrested, Scorpio. Um, if this resonates for you. Uh, for, so for one, it's your son, biological or um, adopted, I'm feeling. For one, it's the baby mama. For one, it's the baby daddy. For one, it's a former lover. For one, it's a lawyer. So I, whoever, however you're connected to this lawyer and how that re resonate. I, I feel guided to pull a kipper. I don't usually pull this until the end, if I do. But my God, I feel guided to the kipper. A lot of arrests coming. You plug it in, how it resonates. Spirit messages you have for Sans Scorpio. Marriage. Okay, I heard stop. Marriage, number three, could be a very significant number in one's life. Number three, marriage. A karmic marriage is about to become very significant in Scorpio's life. And a wedding. A karmic marriage and a uh, and a wedding is about to become very significant in Scorpio's life. So maybe one of you guys is planning this wedding or you're in the wedding party or you are one of the ones about to get married um, or you're attending this wedding. How that resonates in one's life, um, some kind of wedding energy and a karmic marriage. So whoever is in this karmic marriage, whether it's you or somebody you're connected to, um, obviously they 
whoever's in this karmic marriage, they obviously don't love each other. They don't love each other, and obviously they're in it for the money, obviously. Um, whoever these people are. Spirit messages you have, South Scorpio. Confirmation. <clears throat> it's an Army helicopter, because I, I live near an Army base, so... Confirmation, Army helicopter, maybe somebody's in the military, or you know somebody in the military. You plug it in how it resonates, Scorpio. Lamb and gazelle, for some you could be dealing with the earth sign, or double earth sign energy. You have double earth sign energy. If you are, they have Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, and their sun, moon, rising, Venus, Wolf, Moon, Moon, Haven, Jupiter, Charlotte. If you are, Scorpio. We have lamb and gazelle. Some, I feel you could be dealing with two or two plus earth signs. Possibly. Spirit messages you have for sign of Scorpio. Spirit messages you have a sign, Scorpio. Florida is very significant and a police record. Florida is very significant and a police record is what I just heard. So Florida, the state of Florida is very significant for at least one of you guys or somebody you're connected to and a police record. So a police record um, of you or somebody you're connected to. I heard Florida, so the state of Florida and a police record um, of somebody, whether it's you or somebody you're connected to, you plug it in how it resonates. And the state of Tennessee and the state of Alabama. And the state of Tennessee and the state of Alabama. So the state of Florida, the state of Tennessee, and the state of Alabama and a police record is very significant. Um, in your life or somebody you're connected to's life, Scorpio. And the state of Texas. And the state of Texas. We're pulling in lost states. So the state of Florida, the state of Alabama, the state of Tennessee, um, state of Texas, um, and police record or records. And the state of Louisiana. And the state of Louisiana. I don't think that really. Woman, dealings of relationship with a woman, beau, you're highly thought of, base, secret admirer. From a very toxic family, huge secrets are about to come out on child sex trafficking and exploitation involving an earth sign child. Okay, I heard um, for a very toxic family, um, huge secrets are about to come out on child abuse and exploitation of an earth sign child. So I think this is the earth sign child. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo child. They're coming as a lamb energy, very docile and um, probably sweet and meek. And um, they, they're they not a danger to anything or anyone. Um, they have been abused and exploited. Um, but some toxic family has been abusing and exploiting them and huge secrets are about to come out. Now, for some, the huge secrets could come out to you. Or they could come out to somebody you're connected to. Or you could be the toxic family that is abusing and exploiting them or was abusing and exploiting them. How that resonates and applies, Scorpio. Only you know your story and situation, not anybody else. But this poor little child, uh, earth sign child that's been abused and exploited, they're coming in as the lamb energy, very docile and sweet and meek and 
um, uh, not a danger to society because they, the dangerous to society are the ones that have been abusing and exploiting them or has abused or exploited them. So you plug it in how it resonates, Scorpio. They got Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo, and they're semi-minimizing Venus or feminine behavior. You were charged as child. And I've been pulling in a lot of child abuse in here. A lot of child pornography, secret child pornography rings, child sex trafficking, uh, teachers about to report um, children being entrapped in um, child pedophile rings, and all kinds of things. So I'm just saying. For once, a feminine earth sign child. For once, a masculine earth sign child. For one, it's a fem uh, earth sign child. For once, a masculine earth sign child. So you plug it in how it resonates. Maybe for one, you're an investigator about to investigate this. Maybe for one, you're the feds. Um, maybe for one, um, you stand up. Maybe you find out about this abuse and exploitation and you stand up against it. Uh, nobody should be in, involved in any kind of child abuse, exploitation, child pornography ring, sex exploitation, etc., etc. I just want to make that very abundantly clear. Gazelle. A very private relationship with a Taurus Capricorn Virgo, younger Taurus Capricorn Virgo, is about to develop. A very private, um, very private relationship with a Taurus Capricorn Virgo um, is about to develop. So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, Scorpio, uh, whoever this Taurus Capricorn Virgo is, um, it's a feminine. It's a fem. Very private, uh, very private relationship with Taurus Capricorn Virgo feminine. It's about to develop, develop. So here's your, uh, I'm assuming she's an adult. An adult. For one, she's a model. For one, she's a nurse. For one, she's a reader. For one, she's a model. For one, she's a nurse. For one, she's a reader. So whoever you are in this very private um, relationship with this uh, younger Taurus Capricorn Virgo um, Ursa. Um, she could, she, for some, she's a nurse, for some, she's a model, for some, she's a reader. So a light size spiritualist, tarot card reader, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Um, nurse could be, uh, RN, LPN, LVN, CRNP, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And for some, um, she, uh, who was the other one? Um, a model, she's a model. So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, she, I feel she's 35, 34 or below. And she could have uh, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, and her Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Feminine, Hammer, Jupiter charts. But I heard the relationship's about to develop, so I don't know if you guys are going to, um, like, have sex or go out on a date or go out on several dates or move in together or I don't, however the relationship develops and however that resonates and applies, Scorpio, okay? Only you know how the relationship is progressing uh, with this younger Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Femme, okay? And she's an adult. Woman, dealings a relationship with a woman. A very aggressive, angry Libra is about to become very significant in your life. For some, you're going to put her on block. A very aggressive, angry Libra. Um, older Libra feminine. Older Libra feminine. Older Libra feminine. A very angry, aggressive, older Libra feminine. It's about to become very significant in your life. I heard you're about to put her on block. For, for one, for one, you may not put her on block. But whoever this very angry, aggressive, older um, Libra feminine is, she could have Libra in her sun, moon, rising, Venus, or Thun, moon, hammer, Jupiter charts. Um, whoever she is and how she applies to you, Scorpio. Um, for one, she's a family member. For one, she's an ex-lover. For one, she's a reader. For one, she's a family member. For one, she's an ex-lover. And for one, she's a reader. So a tarot reader. Um, whoever this person is. Uh, for one, she's a 
family member. For one, she's an ex-lover, and for one, she is a um, tarot reader. So you plug her in, how she resonates. But she's very angry and aggressive. It sounds like she's about to try to come into your energetic space, or she is in your energetic space. And you're either going to block your energy time, hopefully your money from her. Um, and for one, I heard you are going to put her on block. So I think you're going to put her on block in your phone, and you're not going to communicate with her anymore. For one, you may take other action against her. If she starts getting um, harassing and angry and she starts showing it through text, um, hopefully you screenshot it and send it to the police and get a protection or a restraining order on her ass. But um, but only you know what you're going to do, not anybody else. But she's very angry and aggressive. Um, I, that's not cool. That's not cool. Um, hopefully somebody puts a restraining or a protection order on her, but only you know what you're going to do, not anybody else. But She's, um, I heard she's very angry and aggressive. For one, she's a family member. For one, she is a, a tarot reader herself. And for one, she is a um, ex-lover. So you plug it in how it resonates. Many shocking series of chain of events are about to occur with this person. Negative, shocking, power moments here. Many uh, shocking, negative, shocking um, events are about to occur with this person. Negative, shocking, power moments are about to occur with her. So, um, I think you're going to be the power play mover here and create these, uh, or help create these negative, shocking, tower moment S type energies for her. Um, especially if you have evidence in your phone of some kind of um, aggressive, angry text messages or, or group chats or emails or letters or what have you, what have you. If you have some kind of evidence and proof that she's angry and aggressive towards you. Um, I would put a restraining order against her ass or a protection order or something. Um, get some kind of protection to protect herself. But I'm not you. I'm not here to tell you what to do. But if it was me, that's what I would do. And I'm, I'm serious. So you can take the advice or leave, okay? Bo, you're highly thought of. But I heard many negative tower moments were going to occur for her soon. Uh, I think you're going to be a, one of you guys is at least going to be a catalyst to help create these, whether she's your ex-lover uh, a terror reader or a um, um, family member. She's 40 and above. She has Libra and any aspects of her charts. For one, she is a co-worker harassing you. For one, she is a co-worker harassing you is what I just heard. My God, so there's four of them. For one, she's a co-worker harassing you. My God Almighty. So for one, she's a co-worker harassing you. She's 40 and above. She can have Libra in any aspects of her charts. So uh, if she's a co-worker harassing you, I'd go to your manager, boss, supervisor, or CEO. Or if your um, place has a corporate compliance hotline, report her ass to the corporate compliance hotline. That's what I would do, but you could take the advice or leave it. And I'm serious about that. Nobody should be harassing anybody in a workplace. Period, point blank, bar none. Her, she's 40 and above, she's very angry and aggressive, and she harasses you at a, a workplace. For a number four, if this resonates for you, because I've been in, in this situation before, call the, I, well, you can take the advice or leave it, but if it was me, I'd be calling the corporate uh, compliance hotline and re reporting her ass. Um, I'm serious about that. That is harassment, especially if you have evidence, like screenshots, texts, group chats, emails, or what have you, what have you, of Proof of her harassing you at work. And I'm serious. And if it's a um, um, like an EEOC thing, you could go to the EEOC and file a complaint against her. Um, EEOC is Equal Employment Opportunity Commission. Um, if, and you can Google it if you're not familiar with the EEOC. It helps protect discrimination against discrimination and like sexual harassment and things like that against your... Helps protect your civil rights, basically, in a workplace situation. That's for number four. She's 40 and above, Libra Feminine. Yikes. Bo, you're highly thought of. A compliment from a patient is about to become very significant. And a compliment from a client is about to become very significant. 
a compliment from a patient and a compliment from a client is about to become very significant. So you plug in how it resonates, Scorpio. So you're highly thought of, um, whether it's a patient, um, patient, um, um, compliment or a client compliment. So client compliment, I think you own your own business or you co-own a business. Um, however that resonates, it applies, but your, um, client is about to compliment you for one it's a patient so i think you work in healthcare in some shape form or fashion um i've had many patient compliments and i actually have them saved um when i worked at encompass health rehabilitation hospital from 2017 2017 2018 have all my patient compliment cards from the company i have them i'm going to make a shadow box it's been years but i need to do that i need to do it because they were wonderful and i'm just serious base secret admirer Someone not in your area lives a far distance from you, is about to contact you, is about to shock the hell out of you. About to tell you how much they look up to you. Okay, so someone not in your area, I heard that lives a far distance from you, if that resonates for you, is about to contact you. I heard, um, they do not live in your area. They live in a far distance from you. And they're about to contact you and tell you how much they admire you. So um, they they secretly admire you. Uh, but they're about to come to the light, though. They're about to come to the light and come forward to you in a very positive, copacetic manner. And they're about to tell you how much they admire you. So you do something very positive and copacetic in the universe in a very beautiful way. And they're about to come forward and tell you this. Um, for some, it can be an earth sign. You have double earth sign energy. For some, it could be anybody, anybody else, but um, any other sign. But for some, it could be a femme energy, possibly, I'm feeling, um, about to do this. Because um, it's by the, you're the highly thought of with the secret admirer. So, for actually, I strongly feel for a good majority of you guys, it's probably a femme energy about to do this um, that lives at a distance. But for some, it could be a masculine that takes on heavy femme, possibly. But you plug it in how it resonates, Scorpio. They live at a distance from you. They're about to contact you. Uh, it's going to shock you. They're basically, um, they're about to do this, but they are about to do this. Um, that's beautiful. So secret of my energy, they live at a distance. For one, you're about to get wonderful compliments on your beauty. For one, you're about to get wonderful compliments on your beauty is what I heard. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So for one of you guys, you're about to get wonderful compliments on your beauty. So somebody secretly admires your beauty, but they're about to come forward publicly and tell you that they admire your beauty. Maybe they're going to ask you for beauty secrets or beauty regimen or um, what have you, what have you. I'm not sure, Scorpio. Only you know your story, not anybody else, okay? That's really beautiful. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. Someone's about to get their kids back soon through many shocking series of chain events. It's about to shock the hell out of you. For one, you're going to be happy about this. For one, you're going to be angry. Someone's about to get their kids back soon through many shocking series of chain events. For one of you guys, you're going to be very happy about this. For one, you're going to be very angry. So you have to plug yourself in um, in the situation how you resonate. You're going to be happy about somebody getting their kids back or you're going to be angry. Um, I feel it could be a femme energy about to get her kids back, um, possibly, or a masculine takes on heavy femme, but you plug it in how it resonates, Scorpio.
secret, huge secrets are about to come out about a stolen inheritance soon and an insurance claim that was filed on someone that someone claims somebody was deceased, but they're not. Huge secrets are about to come out soon on a stolen inheritance, I heard, and on um, uh, an insurance claim. I heard that was filed on someone. Um, a family member filed it on another family member. A family member filed it on another family member. So, huge secrets are about to come out on the stolen inheritance soon. So, this could be your stolen inheritance or somebody else's stolen inheritance. Are you bringing the secrets out on stolen inheritance? How that resonates and applies. And for one of you guys, huge secrets are about to come out on um, uh, a family member filed a false insurance claim in the past claiming another family member was deceased. But I heard they're not deceased. They're very much living. And basically, huge secrets are about to come out on that too. So that could be you revealing these huge secrets on this if you know this. Or uh, hopefully you're not the family member that did this, but I don't know. Although you know you're swearing out anybody else, but somehow the huge secrets are going to come out. So I feel for some, you're going about to reveal these huge secrets on this situation. Um, and for or for some, maybe not. Only, only you know where you stand with those situations, not anybody else, okay? Because only you know you're swearing out anybody else. Yikes, man. Oh, well, that's good. I can't say yikes. That's good that those huge secrets are coming out. So you plug it in how it resonates. Let me see if I hear anything else. A wedding invitation soon. And someone is going to look very fire at this wedding. Know this. A wedding invitation soon. And someone's going to look very fire at this wedding. Know this. Holy shit. So this could be you getting invited to this wedding. Or um, you're you inviting someone to this wedding. Or someone you're connected to inviting. Or you convincing someone to invite someone to this wedding. How that resonate? Some kind of wedding invitation. Uh, whether you are inviting someone to your wedding or you're getting invited to a wedding or you're convincing somebody to invite somebody to a wedding, I don't know. Some kind of wedding invitation, a lot of wedding in here, a lot. Uh, wedding invitation, going to a wedding, a karmic wedding, I mean, a karmic marriage. I mean, you plug it in, how it resonates. And I heard the wedding invitation, going to the wedding, so upcoming hasn't happened yet. I heard someone that's going to get invited to this wedding so they're going to get a wedding invitation. Um, I don't feel it's you. I feel it's somebody you're either going to convince somebody to invite to this wedding or they're, you're going to haphazardly meet them at this wedding or you already knew them or what have you, what have you. Or they're going to look fire at this wedding. So fire means looking the bomb, um, looking hot, um, for real, for real, like looking hot, hot, um, fire. So whoever this person is and how that applies, okay? Uh, you plug it in, how it resonates. It could be a femme energy about to get invited to this wedding, or you could be a femme energy convincing someone to invite someone to this wedding. Um, somebody's about to look fire, whether it's a femme or a masculine taking on a femme or what have you, what have you, okay? Someone's health is about to decline so badly, they're about to have to get home health services. And for one person, they already have home health services. They're about to move into a uh, skilled nursing facility. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates. Someone's health is about to decline so bad, they're about to have to get home health services. Uh, so home health care, home, nurse, um, home nursing, home health care. For anybody who doesn't know that. And for one person, they already have home health services. So they already um, utilize home health care nursing services. And they're about to, uh, their health is about to decline and they're about to have to um, move into skilled nursing facility um, services. So that's basically a nursing home for anybody who doesn't know that skilled nursing is. So um, apparently, I mean, it's, 
it's not assisted living it's skilled nursing so i mean it's you know because there's assisted living there's skilled nursing so i mean it's pretty bad to where they'll have to go through skilled nursing how that resonates and applies okay but they're in home health now so it sounds like some kind of huge negative power moment is about to occur where their health is going to decline so badly that it's going to be necessary for them to go to um, skilled nursing is what it sounds like but you plug it in how it resonates i don't feel this is you i feel this is somebody you're connected to um how this resonates for some i feel you could be nurses possibly and maybe you work with these people is what i'm feeling possibly but you plug it in how it resonates scorpio okay all right i love you guys i hope this helped and namaste